Welcome to Late Reviews. Today I'm going to make a very short review slash recommendation video of Long Legs, a movie that is in the cinema now. At least I hope it is Why when this comes out. And that's why I just want to make this short spoiler-free review where I just give you a few ideas that hopefully piques your interest so you'll go out and watch this movie while you can in the cinema because this is quite a good movie. It is not flawless, but it is good and it has a lot of things that make it worth watching. This will be actually for the plot. It will be completely spoiler free. I'm not going to say anything that will spoil any part of the plot for you. I'll give my thoughts about the, the, the overall framework of it. For example, one thing that's just really remarkable about this movie is the cinematography and the sound design. The images are insanely good. The way they show the sets, the way they, they, they film the locations is really good. It really immerses you and it cr makes it very eerie and it it's honestly the suspense uh, and scares. There are some really good scares in this movie and a lot of it is down to the cinematography and the sound design. Those two are the strongest aspects of the movie and they add so much atmosphere to it. It partly reminded me of True Detective Season 1, not so much because of the plot or True Detective Season 3, not so much because of the plot, but because of the atmosphere. It, it has some really good ideas, it's very mysterious and really, this mystery, there's so much about it that really, in, in the first half, two thirds of it, I was completely immersed, the story was really good, it kept building suspense, the Cinematography, as I said, the sound design just just kept me at the edge of my seat. I watched it as, at the cinema, of course, and I, I sometimes heard people just jump behind me. It, it is a very effective movie, and it, it really does it well, and I'm really surprised that Nicolas Cage is in it, because, at least to me, I couldn't recognize him in this role, and the costume design is amazing as well. The acting is good. I would say it's it's not amazing, it's not spectacular, but it's serviceable. The lead especially is good, I think the other characters in the movie are not as good. Nicolas Cage, of course, is giving a brilliant performance, so uh, the acting ranges from being serviceable to being quiet or very good. All the, the, the boxes, it takes all the boxes. It's been a while since I saw a horror movie or a thriller that really had me so immersed, even from the right from the beginning. The opening is insane. It does play, even not just cinematography, it plays with some of these aspects of having a 3x4 frame compared to the, the more 9x16 nine, nine format. And it does a lot with that. It really uses the image quite well in the movie. And, and that it really does so many good things. Where, if for, for me, it failed, and I hope it wouldn't fail for you, because I don't think, I think the ending or what they do with the plot can be very divisive. It was divisive for me. The person I went to see it with also didn't like it that much. We both agreed that it had so many qualities that it's definitely worth watching, but we didn't like, we felt it was a bit cheap and a bit tried and a bit lame the way it, 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 the story ended. Maybe the ending, the, 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 the overall story will be much more appealing to you. It wasn't really to us and honestly, the, we had a lot of questions because a lot of the logic behind it, once you realize what's going on, character decisions don't necessarily make much sense and some of it is very convenient. So it's it's a movie that starts out really strong and kind of fizzles out a bit. And I uh, know, at least it did for me and maybe you'll enjoy it even more. It does get good reviews and I'll give it my recommendation because this is a good movie. It has, it, it really does, it plays well with the formula. It's rare to see a movie that, that's this well filmed and with this good sound design and I think that alone just makes me really recommend you to watch this in the cinema while you, have a, while you still can. And, and that's it for me. Just a small review. I uh, hope you will watch the movie. I hope you will watch it. And of course, uh, I'll be doing sometimes more small reviews of this. Actually, I did. It wasn't a double billing, but I watched it the same day as I watched Romulus, Alien Romulus. So I'll have a short review of that. Well, actually, that's not going to be as short as this one. But if you want to, if you're curious about that movie, maybe watch that one as well. And maybe subscribe. Oh, you can subscribe. I'm not going to force you to. Um, um, but yeah, that's it. Have a nice day.